Hello everybody, welcome to this week's vlog. As you can see, a lot of changes and a lot of things are going on. And uh, boy, we got a lot to cover today. Um, first off, the most important thing. Um, let's just get all our patron stuff out of the way and talk about that. Um, the most important thing is that we are making headway with all our patrons. Uh, some of the stuff has already gone out. Um, I try to send a confirmation email. Um, a lot of stuff is being mailed out this week. During the week, the people that qualified for November will be getting an email sometime this week. We have a lot going on. First of all, there I'm, I am in the middle of prep for Miniature Market's huge holiday sale. And what I mean by that is, is that I'm really trying to do right by my sponsor and really go above and beyond you know all we're supposed to do is basically just make videos and let them use whatever they want but they've been so good to us that I've decided um, as you can see I have a list over over here of close to 2,000 products I think it's over 2,000 products and I've gone through this painstakingly and I've had miniature market send me some of the products so we can break it down. So over on Tuesday, there's a big video coming out breaking down the entire sale. So I'm going to let you guys know seven days ahead of time. Now, why am I doing this? Plain and simple. Number one, it's important for my community and the people in my community. I know how tight money can be. I know how hard things can be that we try to give you a look at something and, and say, hey, this is a good bargain and this will help you out over the holidays. Being able to, to um, point out the good things and the bad things and hopefully give you guys a jump over everybody else so you guys can, can get the things you want and have some really nice things under the tree. Or, or maybe possibly pick up a bunch of things to, to give to somebody or gifts to help you save money because the holidays can be very, very stressful. And I have to thank Miniature Market because they really care about you guys as well. And by giving me this list, they said, Rob, if you want to do this, number one, it helps us because let's face it, I don't care what store you are, you want to make money. Okay, plain and simple. But the thing that, that we're learning and, 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 and the thing that I, I've experienced with Miniature Market is that they continually are trying to get better to serve you better. They really do care. They care about, they care about their customers. They care about return business. They care about every bit of business. Now, does everybody drop the ball once in a while? Yes, but we're trying to fix that. And I say we because I feel I'm a part of Miniature Market because at, over this last year, the sponsorship and, and the relationships that I've built there are very solid and I want them to do well. I want them to do well because I care. I really do care. And these people have been wonderful through me uh, to me. Uh, they've been understanding through uh, tons of sickness with with the Queen and everything else that has gone on uh, And we just continue to excel together and grow together uh, This channel miniature market itself the review corner uh, the guys are doing a wonderful job there uh, You know if you don't like watching videos and you like reading reviews, they've got some great reviews there and of course this channel's never going to change because you're going to hear dogs in the background. Now, what are they barking about? God only knows. But one question was posed to me, okay, and, and, and people were asking is, gee, I want to be a part of this sale, but how do I get a part of the sale if I am international? Well, I went right to the president of the company and asked, I said, listen, I have a strong following overseas and, and, and great people and they want to be a part of this. How can we help them? Miniature Market has made a deal with, um, with the mail company and they are able to offer close to 20% off shipping. Okay, I know shipping's expensive going overseas, but normally 
it is close to to almost 65 cents per ounce to ship overseas. Now, after speaking with Stephen, uh, the owner of Miniature Market, he has been able to make a deal and, and bring it down to 35 cents an ounce. Now, I know that doesn't, that, that seems a lot or doesn't seem much or anything like that, but they really are striving to help our overseas co uh, customers. So if you buy over $100, you're going to be able to get that 35 cents an ounce, okay? Do you, is it going to be a little pricey? Yes, of course it is. But shipping's pricey no matter how you look at it. Trust me, I know. And I do my best. And we're going to continue to strive to try to help the best we can. But we offer the lowest rates shipping from the United States to you guys. We can't ship it free. We can't ship it, you know. It, it, after all, it is a business. But we have to find a way to take care of our overseas friends and and our foreign friends so um, after speaking that I was able to find out that it is 35 cents per ounce so please take a look take a look at the games um, find out how much the games actually weigh and then be able to calculate and understand where it all comes together as far as shipping for you guys overseas and and hopefully you guys can can be a part of the big holiday sale enough about that um our, we have a lot of drawings coming up uh we got our november drawing then we have our christmas drawing uh well it's our not our drawing our our game where we're going to be playing that live uh, i haven't determined what day it, it's going to be uh i'm probably going to probably do it the day before thanksgiving i think that'd be fun to do um so i'm planning on possibly doing something like that uh, also, we're going to have our Thanksgiving live feed gameplay. Uh, Janice, myself, I don't know if the mighty Justin will be involved. It depends what he has going on. And, of course, we are really going to be shining with uh, some of the really... Um, uh, now that we're over $2,000, we do have 30 names to read out. And we have that. Those prizes are upgrading January 1st. I have a huge, huge announcement to make um, in part with Miniature Market and in part with a couple other distributors that is going to come to anybody that is part of our patron. You are going to be blown away by what is going on. I'm hoping it's January 1st. If that date changes, it may be. It's definitely in January. You're going to be very excited to be a part of the patron and some of the other things that we have planned we ha are going to give back to you guys more than we did this year. And let me tell you, we are working our butts off to, to, to fulfill everything, to do everything. And we've had a very tough year, but you want to know something? Like I've said a thousand times, this is a very tough family and we go forward and we are continually trying to give you everything that you have, that, that we can. Now back to the holiday sale. We, I am trying to do 20 games in less than 10 days. Uh, I'm going to be breaking down a bunch of stuff. I think you're going to be seeing a lot of games that I'm going to be showing off and everything like that. I think you're really going to enjoy that. We get back to painting this week, finally. Um, live, at least, or, or taped. Uh, I'm thinking more doing taped uh, the first couple of times. We're taking a week off from uh, Canvas Stories. Uh, we're trying to let our other paintings dry. <laughs> Uh, they're, they're taking a little little slower, but I have a real good story that we're going to do next week. I may do two next week if these other two can dry and I can get them put away. Um, Tuesday, we're going to be doing some live gameplay. You're, there's going to be a ton of videos, more than I've ever put out in a week this week. So please do not be turned off by the fact that you get notifications all the time that I'm putting up a ton of videos. Um, I hope... You know, I know that's aggravating. I know when I, I, I click my thing and I see this one has three videos. I haven't watched this, 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 this. I just click on the channel just to clear it out. It can be aggravating. But I do, I do appreciate your subscriptions. I do appreciate your views and your likes. They really mean a lot. You guys have done so much for this channel. We are very thankful and we are very blessed to have you part of the channel. Um... 
uh, what else should we address? I think that's pretty much it. I'm really happy out here. I really like being out here this part of the year. And um, hopefully we are going to be able to pay to have this particular studio uh, air conditioned. Uh, I plan on trying to get that done in February. So there may be some time that we're going to be in the kitchen for two weeks. I've talked to somebody coming in and we are going to probably try to stay out here permanently. Uh, so we're going to get, we've already insulated doors and stuff like that, but we are going to have some vents out here to pump air conditioning in here since we're getting a new unit. Um, uh, so we're going to be here until we move which we are planning on moving sometime next August, September uh, time frame. Uh, we're planning to move to a bigger house. Uh, we've got some plans that, that the Queen and I hopefully uh, will fulfill. Uh, we're going to keep our family very close uh, on a big piece of land. So that was some of the plans. It really depends on her health, which is something that... Um, we're not ready to talk about, but we will at some point. Um, we've been through quite a bit and we continue to strive. It seems like I'm always saying that and trying to reassure myself some way. Um, let's see, what else was there? Boy, there's some really good games coming out and I, I'm really excited about some things. Uh, some things that we're gonna be painting this week some things I've had to put on the back burner um, and kind of bounce around with a few things. Uh, I'm, I'm trying to stay more relevant. Um, Janice and I really want to get into some uh, more dungeon crawls and stuff like that. I'm looking up because I'm looking at all the Shadows of Brimstone stuff I got to do. And um, uh, that and Dungeon Saga is something big we want to get into. Warhammer stuff we're looking to get into. Um... I want to cover more war games. Uh, you may see me do some more single player stuff uh, where I'm, I'm playing and breaking down a game with you guys, either live. Uh, we've got just so much going on. The holidays are here. Um, I'm trying to get all the filming done. They're out hanging Christmas lights. Christmas lights on November 12th. Really? Really? I'll never understand this family but uh, the Queen's out there supervising and she's putting the children to work as they so should be so this has been long enough I think I've covered everything if you have any questions speaking of which I do have to <laughs> go a little further I've had some because of the internet I've had some email problems if you have emailed me anything please re email it I will answer it within 24 hours I apologize for some of the issues that we've had. Uh, I've talked to M MSN as far as uh, some of the problems that I've had, and they think they've resolved the issue. You can email me at novaprime860 at hotmail.com. If you have any questions about Miniature Market, anything that I can pass along and help and square away, that's what the email's for. I try to make myself very available to all of you uh, I, I have been having some email problems if it hasn't come through please try again novaprime860 at hotmail.com I've got a ton of taping to do I got a ton of things to do and uh, you know what I almost forgot to do I almost forgot to read off the winners of the Vila uh, of uh, this month's this month's uh, patron we have 30 winners this month, and we're giving away some really nice stuff because we're going back to giving away a lot of big stuff. So we, I think you guys are really going to be impressed with this. So let's read off the names as follows. Leland, when you see this, timestamp it so people can go right to it. Mark M., Dave Jones. Now this name killed me because I wonder if people call him Davy Jones. Dun, dun, dun. Uh, what was it? The monkeys? Hey, hey. But, okay, all right. Greg Scott, Kelly Jones, Mary Krieger, Chris Wayne, Shane Vega, Will R. I hope there's okay. Will R. Roddy Fredericks, Philip Washington. I 
believe a two-time winner. Rob Mare. Juan Rodriguez. Michelle Duplain. Phi Zine. Phi Zine. P-I Zine. Kevin Vega. Mark. Why are these such hard names this, this month? Marcus Greenelstein. I hope I, I did not butcher. I'm butchering these names, so I hope I, 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 I do all right. Ted Finley. Lee Cho. Stephen T. Alex Wright. Fred Long. Mark P. Jean Paul. Rick Williams. Anton 970. Espen Freisted, Tim Rosser, Joseph Paul, Pavel, I think, Jonathan Klee, really Jonathan, you don't need anything, Ty McDaniels, those are our 30 winners, congratulations, you will find this list in, um, the uh, guild probably be there tomorrow uh, or whenever uh, Leland gets up and also you will find these here and time stamped again thank you so much thanks for all your time uh, I hope you don't mind but I am going to shut this camera off I've got a ton of stuff to do folks and that's it for this week's vlog as always it is a pleasure to have you all part of this channel and we are very blessed and I thank you.